This battle ball cast is brought to you by Mr. Magic Down Under and DieToRemove.com. Round 1 of the elimination event and I won the die roll. So I'm gonna go first. And I will keep this hand. I got plenty of early threats and I have um, more early removal spells. And I have a threat. This is a um, 24 land build with um, some small variations. So I am running my Magma Jets. And a few other cards. My opponent mulligan down once. That's really good for me. I see no reason why not to take like Dwarly Helix. I do have Jets, so I should be able to find the um, fourth land in a reasonable time. The question here is, do I use Jet um, on turn 2, or do I go with the, um, or just wait it out? I don't know what I'm playing against yet, and there's no real um, draws which I must get. Is he Auras? Please not Auras. Okay, he's not Auras. He's um green white. He's lands. I can't exactly deal with his um line at the moment. So I might be better just racing him. Scout crack on um, Jet in the turn. Swing with the um, Wally Helix. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven damage. I won't die, but I can do four damage with the Phoenix, almost guaranteed. Bring him to nine. Three, that's um, six, seven, eight, six, two, yeah, he's dead. Alright, racing him it is. This is always assuming that my Phoenix doesn't die though, if my Phoenix dies, then I might actually lose. Phoenix dying? No way. That could possibly happen. Hubris. There you go. Dead Phoenix. Plans immediately crumble. Young Pyromancer lets me block. Buy another turn. New Skull Crack to block. Alright. I'll take the Young Pyromancer. My game plan right now is literally just buy time. Here we go. If he can't gain life, 
I can just basically block with both my creatures and hopefully survive. Okay, um... Yeah, I'm considering playing Anger, to be honest. Barasham is absolutely horrible here. Barasham is absolutely horrible there. Skullcrack is not horrible, but not exactly good either. And birds, again, are not horrible, but not exactly good either. So what do I do want? I want the Glare of Heresies. Oh, they're good there. The Dancers. The Addition of Searing Blood. Chain of Rocks. Considering the Walker, not exactly sure that's the correct choice here. Considering um, Anger, again, not exactly sure that's the right choice there. The thing is, um, if he manages to kill all my dancers, then the um, anger becomes good. So that's the fear I go with. So my main like, aggression would be the muta belts. I don't really think you'll get too much bigger anyway. I can throw away any lands I see. Yeah, that's an excellent draw. Searing blood. Annoying elephant. Ah, oh, that's my fret. I do need a fret. But, I'll wrap up something else. Glare of heresy. That may be incorrect though. Goofy creature. An elephant. I'll hit the elephant. Now jet this creature. These cards aren't bad. I'll throw away the chains. I'll actually, I'll throw away both cards. Looking for a threat. I should have kept the Muta Belt, actually. That wasn't my misplay. Four, eight, ten. Yeah, well, I can just chain the worms. I don't really care too much. Yeah. 
Here we go. My first friend. The problem is I have zero opportunity to actually play the threat if he plays another creature. Like so. Don't have brave, don't have brave, don't have brave. But there. Finally out of cards. GG